to the TGYK podcast and vidcast, which is actually the very first one that we've done on the channel, considering, well, we did one, like a live Q&A on the Mm. channel before, but now we're at, if you've you've not seen the new space that's behind us, we're at the official Tokyo YouTube space. Super awesome. Hey, thanks for for checking out, and a huge thanks for the Tokyo YouTube space for letting us film and uh, do our our thing. This is the first time uh, the three of us have been in Japan, Tokyo, Japan, and it's great. So that's what our topic is going to be, just like our experiences in Tokyo, like what we what, what what we've done in Japan, just like the fun things and like just getting to know uh, the city, and we'll also like recommend things. So if you're new and you're wanting to travel to Japan and check out some stuff, we're gonna let you know what what's good. We're, yeah, no, we're, we're now certified uh, experts <laughs> after being here for like six days, five days. <laughs> uh, but anyways, I'm Seb. I'm Kevin. I'm Nico. And we are that guy you know. So we are coming. We're not coming live. We wish we were. If, That'd be dope. Yeah, because it does look like an official like TV set it that does. we're in right now. It says YouTube. It says, yeah, like, <laughs> I, I, like just Kevin, can you make sure we're, like, we didn't just green screen it behind us? Can you like? Consider it done. Yeah, yeah. Just to show that we didn't just green screen this. It's a real backdrop. <laughs> <laughs> it's a real backdrop. <laughs> yeah, it's a real backdrop. And I, a special thanks to uh, Seth Nico from Yours Truly for manning the cameras. Hey. We'll throw a picture of her somewhere. Like, hey, <laughs> hey there she is. <laughs> So the Tokyo YouTube space, or it's one of many YouTube spaces around the world. You would come, and then you get to rent equipment, book the studio space. Uh, we even got refreshments. Free Red Bull. Free Red Bull. Get lit before the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good, and um, so it's really, really awesome opportunity if you're like a new creator and you just hit uh, 10,000 subscribers. Definitely check it out. Uh, for those that are in the states, there's one in LA. We thought it'd be super cool because we're all traveling to Japan to use the Japanese YouTube space. And so far, I love it. It's really nice. We have a beautiful view. Yeah, hell yeah. Uh, it's on the Tokyo. One of, Tokyo. second from the highest floor up here, dude. Yeah, 29th floor. Yeah, and You dude. can see Tokyo Tower behind us. Yeah, dude. That's where all the, uh, the... So if you're in an anime, that's where you would go and a magical deity or... Um, uh, samurai spirit would grant you your power. A samurai spirit. Yeah, as soon as you like Talking enter. Shaman King. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as you enter your like newest first year of high school, that's that's probably where you get your powers. Mm. Yeah. But let's just start off. So, uh, what were, what's kind of like your first impressions when you came to Japan, like Tokyo, Japan? It's a lot of people, dude. Mm. Yeah. So people. many people. Yeah. Very much. Uh, I guess when like coming right off the plane, I'm just like, it's okay. I like it here, dude. Yeah. Every it's it's very quiet compared to a lot of places. Is in like not when you're on the street, but as mm. soon as you get on like the public transportation, mm. everyone's like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very different from back home in Vancouver, where uh, like people be chatting, having like really loud conversations on the on our Sky Train versus here. If you do that, you know they'll they'll. So no no no. No. Don't do that. Yeah, survival tips in Japan. Don't don't talk too loud on the trains. This that's a good topic. Yeah man. Yeah. What about you, Kevin? Uh, eat food. Food is good. So good. Uh, food is really good. A large variety of uh, consumable uh, yeah, mm, that's, stuff. Yeah, that's food, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I'd have days where I just plan around what I wanted to eat that day. I was like, ooh, what can I eat today? Curry? But what's around curry that I can once go and oh, see? Because okay. <laughs> uh, I think our first meal was ramen, and then we've had a lot of uh, convenience store onigiri. Uh, that's the other thing. If you are traveling to Japan on a budget, uh, onigiri is pretty cheap. It's pretty good, and you can get, if you're thirsty, there is vending machines everywhere. Mm-hmm. Like, we, we are in the middle of a park, and it looks like there is nothing but trees, and and pathways and then boom vending machines like right there yeah and I've never seen anyone refill a vending machine that's the so that's the secret the vending machine ninjas dude yeah <laughs> they're just waiting in the trees with like stacks of like boss coffee <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> 
Or just <laughs> r- repels down and then yeah. puts it in the machine and repels back up. Oh, so like, what would you guys recommend for if someone's going to Japan and they say, uh, what's the first kind of food I should try? Ooh, that depends. I, yeah. I think ramen. I think that's a ramen? classic. Pretty classic? Yeah. What about you? What about you? Yeah. Curry is life right now, dude. Curry? Everything is curry. Yeah. I, uh, because I introduced, um, well, he, he heard it, they both heard about it before. But yeah, we watch uh, anime, dude. Yeah, we watch <laughs> anime. That's why we came here. <laughs> uh, uh, kureba, uh, so it's like pretty much a donut, but fried on the outside has bits of, uh, it's kind of like panko, which is what they put tempura. And then inside is just Japanese curry, mm. and it's amazing. Yeah. With meat. With meat. What's the, what's the like, w- wildest experience you've had so far? Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, like, the thing that's m- most memorable, like, so far. Well... One of the few, I mean. Well... Uh, these, this, this has been floating around on, like, both Facebook and, uh, I think, Kotaku, which is, like, not, um, a geeky website and blog. Marikar? Like oh, Marikar! Marikar? Yes. That was uh, that was really fun because so basically what it is yes. is you you go to this place you make a reservation and they put you in go karts with you and however many people you book with and you just drive they give you like a tour through Tokyo and like depending on how long you book the tour for they'll show you more places but you're basically in souped up go karts just <laughs> going yeah. down the street like so alongside like taxis goodness. and trucks and whatever yeah. And they have costumes. They do. Okay, so they give you uh, Mario costumes to wear, you mm-hmm. know, like to in your Mario Kart. Because it makes sense, like Mario, yeah, Mario costume, Kart. Mario Kart. We decided to be Dragon Ball Z characters. Yeah. <laughs> but it wasn't even like it was our version of Dragon Ball Z characters. So I it, thought it was pretty realistic. <laughs> we'll find a picture of this guy in his. Co- well, actually, we'll throw up a picture somewhere of like what we look like. But then the best part is also uh, because Nico was still wearing his hat and his bandana, and then he wore the orange uh, like outfit over his black clothing. So he just looked like a prisoner. I look like a convict. <laughs> it's like the orange <laughs> jumpsuit con- type yeah. thing. So that, that was a pretty fun experience because we, I was, I've seen uh, videos of it online. Uh, it was just one of those things that I found out after we, I, we left from our first time in Japan. Mm. And it's, uh, it's one of those things like when you go your first time, there are things you'll discover that, oh, I wish I did them. Uh, but I didn't have enough time. Mm-hmm. So I definitely recommend uh, going once to kind of orient yourself with the city, the mm-hmm. things you've done. So have like a checklist of what you want to do. Second time you come back, like go through your checklist and go to maybe things that you didn't get a chance to do the first time. Mm-hmm. Like uh, what, were, what were some of the things on your list of what you wanted to do in Japan? You, w- you woke up like super early this morning I to do did. that yeah, 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 Tsukigeki fish market thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, uh, it's a su- su- Tsukiji. Oh, yeah. Tsukiji fish market. Mm. Is, uh, I didn't. I, the first time I came here, I didn't really get to experience it. Yeah. I did go, but it was like uh, when they were closing down because they closed really early and they opened early. So this morning I went there. Uh, I got to eat some fresh fish. Super fresh. fresh. It was still like, like, like electric boogaloo waving. When it <laughs> <comes through. laughs> Tuna too, electric boogaloo. <laughs> One of the other things that I've always wanted to know is. Your most memorable, I guess, like billboard or, or ad or Ooh. like thing that you've seen. Because like uh, you guys have probably known if you're on YouTube, you know how like amazing Japanese commercials are and the ads are. I'd like to do a challenge of ad placement posing challenge. Ooh. So using this phone as like your, the what you're trying to sell, yeah. give me your best kind of like uh, Japanese ad model face. Okay. Ready? On. All right. I'll give you in three. Two, one. <laughs> that's so gross, dude. I, uh, I that's feel not, disgusting. That's good, that's good, I that's feel good. like I've sold myself. Okay, no, that's good. I, 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 I would, uh, I would buy that. Yeah, yeah I would buy that. Yeah. Uh, good. In three, two, one. One. I love it. Oh, that's that's not bad. That's not bad. That's do not the bad. do do the Korean style holding a beer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mucus. Shibuya and Harajuku. If you're really into like Japanese fashion, that's pretty much like an a- those two areas are what you want to mm-hmm. hit hit up. Uh, when we were in Shibuya, because we went to 109 Men's, which is the guys' version of Shibuya 109, mm-hmm. and each floor has its own distinct style. So if you're into like uh, street hip hop, or if you're into like 
J Rock or Visual K for mm -hmm. him to just kind of like um, Justin Bieber style, <laughs> Justin Bieber, style. <laughs> like preppy SoCal thing. style. SoCal, mm -hmm. uh, I just came from the beach style. It's just it's really cool. Like just the different. Um, tears. Mm -hmm. and, oh, there's another good survival tip. Look up when you're looking for things because yes. unlike in North America where everything is just spaced out, like you go to a mall and then you just kind of walk in a giant like area. Here because it's a big city and there's so many people, a lot of it is like vertical. So you have to look up and see ninth floor this is this, eighth floor could be a karaoke, mm -hmm. Sixth floor is like contact lens yeah. stores. Twenty ninth floor is YouTube. Space. Yeah, twenty ninth floor is YouTube. Space. <laughs> the majestic view of yeah. uh, the city. Yeah. Just uh, one more, one more kind of like fun game I want to throw in there, just to get our get our our bodies and blood moving. Okay. I want to see your guys's best kind of like main character pose. Ooh. Main character. Drawing pose. upon your extensive knowledge of many like anime genres throughout your entire viewing history. I want to do your pose. You My pose. pose. Oh, <laughs> sure. You have like four seconds to think about it, so one, two, these are really short seconds, so three, and four. Okay, have you internalized it? Have you gathered your, your chakra, your energy? I guess so. Okay, all right, so I'll do, I'll, 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 I'll start it this time. Okay. Right, so I need you to count me down from three. Ready? Kevin, all you gotta do is one. count. <laughs> yeah. From three. Yeah. Kevin, all you gotta do is count. One, mm. two, mm. three. <laughs> Holy shit. I thought you were gonna fall on me. <laughs> yep. Uh, I don't know. I can't, I can't think of one, man. I'll, right. I'll do mine seated. <laughs> all right, Kevin, you're up next. Ready? Ready? In three, two, one. Oh, kawaii. Which, oh, which character is that? Oh, the school idols. Oh yeah, he's, he's like the, the cute boy. You have that's to be like... frozen mid-air though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not man. bad, not bad. I'll throw some like magic rainbows and like soft focus over you over that. Oh, you know, yeah. just, you and and, and you have to add the, the sound effect with those. Wow! <laughs> 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 Alright, Nico, last one. I don't have any... I'm sure you have a lot. Ready? In three, oh, no. two, one. <laughs> the guy with the eye from Dragon Ball. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? What's his name? Tian. Tian? Yeah, Tien I got <laughs> Oh boy. Are you solar flaring? Yeah, dude. Oh. <laughs> See, it's iconic. What am I telling you? Just to wrap things up. Huge thank you to the Tokyo YouTube Space Hell for yeah, letting dude. us use it, and this super awesome like Michael Jackson light up dance floor yeah, that's this is like ten like, lights on me. Yeah, I wore like, like the brightest shirt I could find. Now I'm probably like invisible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like they, they have access to like sets and uh, lights and cameras, and uh, really, really great for like creators to meet mm -hmm. up and collab. Like, uh, you know, if we ever if we ever back here, I'd love to do some collabs with some of the like, Japanese YouTubers. Yeah. Uh, if you guys are watching this, please feel to contact us. We'd love to work with you guys. Yeah, yeah. It's, it only fun. costs like a million dollars to fly here. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, thanks again for watching. Uh, leave in the comments uh, what you guys thought, or if you've been if you've been to Japan yourself, uh, share your your story, your experience, or what you guys think would be awesome. Maybe we, maybe we need a chance to do it yet. Mm. But um, yeah, just like let us know in the comments and feel free to leave a like or yeah. subscribe. Yeah. To these lovely faces you see yeah. in front of us. Yeah. Yeah. Special thanks to Miss Stephanie from Yours Truly for helping us film today. There she is! <laughs> uh, and for all the staff at the YouTube space for uh, being really friendly, helping us set up. So can't thank you guys enough. Mm. Hope you guys enjoy this video. We'll catch you guys next time. I'm Seb. I'm Nico. I'm Kevin. And we're that guy, you know, if you don't know, now, now you, you know. know. Hey!